and welcome to my channel. My name is Alexey, and today what we're gonna be doing is taking a look at panning mixing tricks I learned from Warren Hewitt. Warren Hewitt is a wonderful producer, sound engineer, and a songwriter who created one of the best communities, Produce Like a Pro Academy. I've been a student of Produce Like a Pro Academy since 2018 and learned and still learning so much from Warren. Thanks to his videos and courses, I could put my mixing skills on a new level and became better at mixing. Today, I will show you pain and mixing tricks I learned from Warren Hewitt, which will help you to make your mixes sound better. Please don't forget to check out Produce Like a Pro YouTube channel, a link will be in the info box of this video. And of course, you are more than welcome to join Produce like a pro academy and develop your mixing skills and make your mixes sound on a professional level. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope this video will be useful for you. Our first panning trick is called pan affected source opposite of the dry source. So in this case, we have our guitars here, and we have here our right guitars, our left guitars, and so on. So if we want our guitars to make wider in our mix, we can create two delays. So in this case, we can create our guitar delay left and our guitar delay right. Then to make our guitars sound wider in the mix, we can send our guitar delay left to our right guitars and we can send our guitar delay right to our left guitars. Now let's have a listen to our guitars in the mix. Let's have a listen to our guitars one more time without any delays. Our second panning trick is called create ear candy and additional movement. So in this case, if we want to create some additional movement, we can take our lead vocals here and we can use automation for our lead vocals pen to pen our lead vocals to the left and to the right pretty quickly, let's say at the end of our chorus to create some movement on our lead vocals. So let's have a listen to our lead vocals only. Don't open my eyes. The battle is done and I think that you won. Don't open my eyes. Take my own hurt and save my life while I can. Don't open my eyes. And now let's have a listen to our lead vocals in the mix. Don't open my eyes. The battle is done, and I think that you won. Don't open my eyes. Take my own hurt and save my life while I can. Don't open my eyes. Our next panning trick is called create excitement with automating panning on harmonies. So in this case we have our vocal harmonies and if we want to make our harmonies sound wider in the mix. So for instance we can pan our harmonies to the left and to the right, let's say on the chorus part of our song. So let's have a listen to our vocal harmonies only. You knock me out and I can barely breathe. It's 
so hard my heart skips a beat. All I need is a little release. Oh, oh, oh. Don't open my eyes. The battle is done and I think that you won. Don't open my eyes. Take my own hurt and save my life while I can. Don't open my eyes. And now let's have a listen to our vocal harmonies in the mix. You knock me out and I can barely breathe. Hit so hard my heart skips a beat. All I need is a little release. Oh, don't open my eyes. And our final trick is called using pennant in a different sections of a song. And if originally our guitars, for instance, on our chorus part, were placed in the center, so to make our guitars sound wider in our chorus part, we can pen our guitars to the left and to the right on our chorus part. So let's have a listen to our guitars only. And now let's compare this chorus part section of our guitars to our second chorus where our guitars are placed in the center only. And now let's have a listen to our guitars in the mix. Don't open my eyes. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you liked the video. Please don't forget to check out Produce Like a Pro YouTube channel and please don't forget to check out Produce Like a Pro Academy. All the links will be in the info box of this video. And see you next time.